Management of GCB Bank has assured customers of the SWL, UT and Capital Banks that their deposits are safe. This follows the mad rush by customers to withdraw their money from the accounts. The management also allayed fears of shareholders that the takeover would affect their shares. Sarah Fori reports. I am very pleased to report on the swift and smooth exercise which occurred at all the 53 branches upon the assumption. After the due diligence performed at the branches with the collaboration of the staff of the two institutions, our branches opened as planned to serve customers. It is a sign of excellent things to come and we promise to make a marked difference in customer service experience going forward. GCB's takeover implies that the staff and customers of UT and Capital Banks now belong to GCB, but management of the three entities, that is, the SWAL UT and Capital Banks and GCB, were tight-lipped about aspects of the takeover, leveraging on its feet as the most profitable bank of the year, and with over six decades of experience in banking, GCB says deposits of clients of the two banks will be managed well. We will take this opportunity to assure all depositors of the two erstwhile banks. Your deposits are protected. You can go to the branches that you have used time, from time immemorial and you will be served. Integration process which started immediately after the takeover announcement by the Bank of Ghana on Monday is ongoing. The duplication of accounts, in fact, the two institutions have a system which is different from ours. We are going to have to let them run for the moment and we will run our system. So whilst it's a duplicate account, because we are on different platforms, we need to take our time. As we merge the platforms, the customers themselves will let us know how they want to um, bring the accounts over. Former directors of the UT and Capital Banks now serving in their capacities as Chief Operating Officer and Chief Financial Officer respectively under GCB also took turns to address the customers. I know they are concerned about the service and product delivery. Uh, we want to assure them that GCB Bank is prepared to give them the ultimate service, quality that they deserve. They are part of a bigger and stronger bank and we want to give them all the assurances that we want to end their business and retain their business. There are unique characteristics of the bank that the customers like. And why we've gone in there for strategic reasons is that uh, we see opportunity for growth. And that opportunity for growth can only come when you have the customers on board. The customer service that we're used to, we are going to even enhance it a lot better. GCB's current network is 214, positioning it to attract more deposits at lower costs and interest rates. Zero.